black iron butcher box steak, pasture raised eggs, grass fed butter, Malden flaky salt. This is almost 1800 calories. This is what I eat after workout on the carnivore diet. Mm. Baby, that's good. I was gonna cook this flat iron steak a little longer. I'm glad I did it rare. It's almost like a filet. Ray, why do you eat so much? I ate according to my appetite. I would encourage you to do the same. When I first started carnivore, it's like I never ate. I did. It was like once a day. There was one day I didn't eat at all just because I wasn't hungry. When I lost about 50 pounds, it took me a month and a half, two months, probably seven, eight weeks. That's when my appetite really started to get strong. After every workout, I just wanted to devour food. If you're not hungry, don't force yourself to eat on carnivore. At least when starting out. It's a really good way to make yourself nauseous. Everything just seems gross. When you're listening to your hunger cues, ooh, steak sounds good right now. Bowl of ground beef and eggs sounds phenomenal. Shoot, you know what? I think I'm gonna make that chuck roast tonight. Eat up, baby. Don't look at me eating this meal and think that you need to put this down too. You don't, and you probably won't, and that's okay. You also don't need to eat butter like this. I do it because butter's a superfood, one of the healthiest fats that you can eat, and because I love it. I know, still weird. You would've told me a year ago I'd be eating straight up butter. Would have laughed in your face. I saw somebody else do it, tried it, and it was freaking good. I mean, it is just cream. It's cream that was mixed up and made butter. Anyways, solid grass-fed steak, solid pasture-raised eggs, solid grass-fed butter. 10 out of 10 recommend.